winter squash paired with Pinot Noir. Growing your own winter squash gives you a lot more options than what you can get at the grocery store. Winter squash comes in a variety of interesting colors and shapes. It is sweeter, denser, and more firm in texture than zucchini and other summer squashes. And unlike summer squash, which is soft, winter squash develops a hard outer shell, making it suitable for, you guessed it, winter storage. It is low in calories and high in nutrients and minerals and a great addition to winter meals. Here's an easy recipe you can make with winter squash. Cook two slices of diced bacon until crispy. Remove bacon and set aside. In the same pan, cook one small shallot, slice thin for four or five minutes or until it begins to brown. Add one clove of minced garlic, fresh thyme, and cook until fragrant, about one minute. Place the shallot mixture in a mixing bowl. Add one and a half cups of bread cubes using a baguette or other crusty bread. Add three quarters cup grated cheese. Add the bacon. Pour in three tablespoons of heavy cream and stir until everything is moistened. Add half teaspoon of salt and fresh pepper. Take one acorn squash half and rub with olive oil coating the edges and the cavity. Sprinkle with salt and pepper. Divide the stuffing between the halves, packing it in so that the squash can still lie flat when it's turned upside down. Place the squash halves upside down in a baking dish or pan. Bake for about one hour until the flesh of the squash can easily be pierced with a knife. Once the squash is cooked, use a spatula or two to flip them over. Serve as is or slice down the middle. The squash pairs well with a lighter wine, so we suggest this Tangly Oaks Pinot Noir. The earthly undertones of this wine, as well as the lively red cranberry notes, pair perfectly with squash. Enjoy the bounty of your garden with fall recipes like this.